Good morning everyone. Today we will do chapter number 3 the query. We have already finished chapter number 1. Welcome to new class. And chapter number 2 balance diet. I hope you have done their exercises. Today we will do chapter number 3 the query. Before we start let us discuss some words which we are going to use in this poem what does quarrel means quarrel means a heated argument or disagreement in other word we can say that quarrel means fight but not physically generally it takes place between siblings and good friends like for example most of the kid fight with their brother or sister for mobile phones tv remote and for many other things now you will see a similar kind of video an argument between the brother and sister you got to be quiet when i sing in the notes say no I hear you say no way In this poem there are three insects are going with each other three of them are as following first firefly second glowworm and third lightning bug have you ever seen these insects this one is a firefly and this is how it look in a day time and in, in night this one it how it looks in the night this one is a glow worm in day time and this one is a glow worm in night see how beautiful this is it look quite beautiful no and the other one this one is a lightning bird in day time and this is in the night time this is how they glow in the night have you ever noticed one thing like three of them shines at night so let us start this poem first i shall read this poem for you and then i will explain it the quarrel name of the poet maxine cumin said a lightning bird to a firefly look at the lightning bug flies by silly dunes said five said the fly what a bug ever flew those are fly five flies and so are you bug cried bug fly cried flies wait said a glow worm happening to be nearby i am worm scream the worm i glimmer all night you are worms both of you i know that i am right fly cried fly worm cried worm bug cried bug i am standing firm back and forth through the dark each shouted hid his word till they quarrel awaken the early bird
You three noisy things. You all are related. She said to the worm and promptly, promptly ate it. With her snap of her will, she finished the fly and the lightning bug was last to die. All glowers and gleamers, there is a moral. Shine if you must, but do not quarrel. So, now I will explain the poem. In this poem, there were, back pardon, in this poem, there are three insects arguing with each other. Just to prove themselves to be a superior over one another. First, the first conversation between the lightning bird and the firefly. They are talking to each other. Said a lightning bug to a firefly, look at the lightning bug flies by. So this uh, lightning bug said to the fireflies that those flying things are lightning bug. The five then the firefly said silly don'ts said the fly what bug ever flew those are fireflies and so are you. Firefly said, you dumb, have you ever seen any bug flying? Those are not bug, those are fireflies and you are also a fireflies, not a bug. Bug cried the bug, fly cried the fly. So here, Bug is saying no, those are bugs. And the firefly is saying no, they are fireflies. So here, as you, you can clearly see, they are disagreeing with each other. So they are fighting with each other by words, not physically. Wait. Said a glow worm happening to be nearby. I am warm, scream the worm, I glimmer all night. You are warm, both of you. I know that I am right. So, when these two are arguing with each other, glow worm is just passes nearby and he stopped there and then he starts saying, that no, I am warm and I know that you are also warm and the fireflies is also warm. So this worm said that we all are warm. Fly cried fly, worm cried worm, bug cried bug, I am standing firm. So as here you, we can clearly see that, that each of them is trying to prove themselves right. Firefly is saying that those all are fireflies. Worm is saying those all are worms. And the bug is saying those all are bugs. Back and forth through the dark, each shouted his word. So they start they, they started to quarrel very loudly till their quarrel awakened the early bird. So what happened? There was a bird sleeping nearby and when they started shouting that early bird wake up. Oh, sorry, the early bird woke up. And she said, you three noisy things, you all are related. She woke up and she said, you three noisy things, 
you all are similar you all are same she said to the worm and promptly ate it she just said those word and she ate the worm with her snap of her will she finished the fly and the lightning bug was last to die so the bird was very angry and what she did she ate worm first and then she ate flies and then so the bird ate all of them so she ate bug worm and fireflies all glowers and gleamers there is a moral shine if you must but don't quarrel so the moral of the story is we should never quarrel it only does harm to us and our relation with each other so we should never quarrel so i have finished this uh, chapter so now we will move to exercises think and answer a tick the correct option who said look at the lightning bug fly by so here we can see said a lightning bug to a firefly look at the lightning bug fly by so we can clearly see here that the lightning bug said those word to firefly so here we will take option number b bug rest you will have to do it now moving further b right true or false all the three were related to each other so this is what bird said in the poem the bird said that you noisy three things you all are related so we will write true here and then you will have to do this first moving further complete the following sentences the three of them got killed they got killed because they who three of them these three of them were got killed because they were quarreling because they were fighting now d answer the following question who three were fighting so insects who three were fighting fireflies glowworm and lightning bird were fighting so rest you will have to do it now moving further vocabulary part read the following word carefully and make a short word from these words so we will have to make a short word from these given words glimmer so we can make from glimmer we can make line girl germs and gleam so rest you will have to do this thank you and have a nice day please stay home and stay safe